So the evidence shows, and this is government's own figures, uh, and other people analyze them as well, that a British Muslim is eight times more likely to be referred to the channel program under Prevent, yeah? Um, now, you might say, well, what's the big deal about that? But that shows it's clearly discriminatory. Channel is a practical component of the Prevent strategy, which the government claims provides early support to vulnerable people who are at risk of being drawn into terrorism before they get involved in terrorist-related activity. The most recent data up to 2019 showed that 90% of referrals to Channel were unwarranted, i.e. basically they were assessed and they were found that they didn't have to go through the de-radicalization program essentially, yeah? There were other issues going on, whether it's health, education, whatever. Now, 90% is a hell of a lot, yes? If you had a drug licensed in the UK that only had a 10% success rate, what would you think about it? 